setting up your accounts in iBank couldn't be easier. If you aren't importing your transaction data from a QIF file, adding accounts should be the first thing you do in iBank. Start by creating an iBank account for each financial account you have in real life – checking, savings, credit card, mortgage, for example. To begin, click the Add Account button on the toolbar. The new account assistant will appear. Enter a name for the new account. Choose the appropriate account type and select a primary currency to use for the account. Click Next to continue. iBank will ask you to choose a financial institution. You can easily find yours by starting to type the name in the search field. If you can't find your bank on this list, select Other Financial Institution. You can see that this bank offers a direct download method. Some banks only offer downloads via their website. More on this in a minute. Click Next. Because I'm using Direct Connect, I can now enter my user ID and password I use for direct downloads. If you are not enrolled for direct downloads, you can go back to the previous step and choose a web download option if available. If not, you can select this account is not at a financial institution. Note that some banks require a different login and password for direct downloads than the ones you use for general online account access. Click Connect and iBank will connect. It will display all of your accounts it finds at the institution. Select the one you're setting up for this iBank account and click Next. iBank will download your available transaction history. Next, you are given an opportunity to categorize your transactions. iBank will learn from the changes and help you automatically categorize them in the future. Your account is now set up in iBank. You can set up all different types of accounts in iBank checking, savings, loans, credit cards, and more. You will be asked for additional information when setting up loans and credit card accounts. Let's set up a credit card account using web downloads. If your institution only supports a web download of your transactions, you will get a web download screen in the Setup Assistant. If you have online access to this account, click Download iBank will launch an integrated web browser. Log into your account here. In your account details, find where you can download your transactions. The best choice here is OFX data, which corresponds to Microsoft Money. You can also download transactions in the QFX format, often called Quicken Web Connect, or in a QIF file. When you click this link, iBank will automatically import the data. Alternatively, you can drag and drop a file with your downloaded transactions. For additional help with this topic, see the iBank help files under How do I add accounts?